Sire, I'm sorry. I'm afraid that I won't make for good company. Lively there, lads and lasses! I promised the merchants and their prince we'd be off before the tide. You, man, carry that properly. That porcelain is worth more than your life. Uh, some children we'd be best to refuse. Captain Vasco. And you are? I'm de Sade, the prince's nephew. If all is in order, we will soon be embarking on your boat. It's a ship. Not a boat. Apologies. Apologies for my asking, but the young governor isn't with you. He didn't come home this morning. I need to find him before departure. I hope nothing's happened to him or he hasn't changed his mind. The tide does not wait. <laughs> Perhaps he simply celebrated his imminent departure with a little too much enthusiasm. Is everything ready? We're short a crew member. The cabin boy is missing. But have no fear, we will leave without him if he does not present himself before the tide. Is he an important member of the crew? We don't need him for sailing or navigation. He's only a cabin boy. He must have simply had a bit too much to drink in celebrating his departure. Like another I know. I doubt that. Jonas was never one to fancy drink. And it's been two days since last he was seen. No, I fear something bad has happened to him. Might I ask you, if you hear anything, could you report it to me? I would like to set sail with a clear mind. When did you see your cabin boy for the last time? It's been two days since I've had any news at all. It wasn't out of the ordinary until this morning. My men have free shore leave when we're at dawn. But the day of departure, every able-bodied sailor must be present on the ship. When did you see your cabin boy for the last time? It's been two days since I've had any news at all. It wasn't out about the day of depart. Does the boy know anyone? Other than fellow Norts. I don't think so. Does the boy know? Other... Have you seen anyone wandering? Take a look around. As long as they don't try and get upset. A smuggler. In the port jails. Why I ask you? Why the sudden injury? A couple of heretics are planning on leaving Serene. The ambassador of Teleme has entrusted me. Happy to see that you trust me enough to seek my counsel in the affair. Just so happens that I heard someone talking about the couple. They are making quite some ruckus, asking to search our warehouses. We, of course, refused entry. I'm, I'm sorry, Your Excellency, but I'm certain you're a potential stowaway. But we won't allow you to make a search to grab them. Not officially, at least. What do you mean? That discretion and malice are often... You haven't heard anything about my cousin by chance, To be you? honest, we were hoping to find him. Did you say he was intending on... My men spoke of a rather animated party. That isn't the safest place in the city. Let's go and find him. Thank you. Happy to be of some help. I have a favor to ask before we leave. I'm all ears. 
We would like to load some merchandise into your ship's hold. Impossible. You're too late for that. Also, unless you're asking me. I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> well then, they'll have to wait. Hellfire. If that ship... Captain, I understand you... I doubt it. Even if I wanted to help you. My... He's gone into his head that a gang of... He's placed guards where our cargo is being held. All that is not in the warehouse and noted on the map. Sorry, but your crates are gonna have... <sighs> Sorry, Kurt. The commander is gonna have my head. In that case, we're going to have to dock to the manifest. Be back soon, Captain. We need to have a word with that people smuggler the sailor mentioned. He's a captain, Kurt, like yourself. And in order to interrogate the smuggler, we'll need to find a way into his jail. Do you have any idea how to get in there without being noticed? Let's take a look around the building. We might find a less conspicuous entrance. Where is the manifest to be found? I've already been to the port authorities. They keep the official documents upstairs. a norm uniform and you were able to keep your mark hidden from them they might let us in unless we just offered them a drink these sailors rarely refuse one i see where this is headed if we drop a little soporific in their glasses the way will be clear i'll just need to find the proper ingredients but it's doable
You cannot pass. Only the north. Halt! Can't you make an exception? No. Sorry, sir. Very well. I'm good. Orders up. Very well. I'm going. Captain, sir, we were given... You're going to have to wait. We need... I wish you a good day, Your Excellency. Tavern keeper. I see you're back. I'm looking for my cousin. There was indeed a... Whatever do you mean? A brawl broke. I'm sorry. Hair down to his neck. I don't believe it. I hope you've come to reimburse me. <sighs> what kind... A good half of my furniture was broken. Let me take a look. Perhaps it can be... If you can fix it... <laughs> Here you are, to cover your expenses. Excellent. Honest books makes for honest friendship. <laughs> Your cousin is either a very bad joker or a right good fool. Dangerous fellows. They've a stalk. What kind of business do they run? Several, actually. And in any case, if you were set on recovering your cousin. Thank you for the information. Off with ya. Get him out of whatever. Anything else? I need to be off. Goodbye.
will discover some useful information. 